Hi guys, it's Frankie from Frankie Tech. Good to see you guys again. And here on my lunch break, just wanted to chime in on this very interesting subject. So I wanna shout out Prakar, who actually responded to one of my recent tweets that he had just picked up an iPhone 12. At first I was like, okay, you know, good for you. iPhone 12 is a cool product and it still represents, I think, a lot of great value, you know, as for an iPhone. Uh, of course, I know the situation in India has always been really tough in terms of getting iPhones and the pricing, I'll admit, hasn't made much sense until now. Because then I learned that basically that iPhone 12 was a made in India, assembled in India iPhone. And what does that mean? That the price on these new iPhone 12s is so much better than it ever was before. And you can basically pick up an iPhone 12 mini for around 40,000 Indian rupees, 49 for the higher tier storage models, and you can pick up an iPhone 12 for around 50,000 Indian rupees. You know, that's still in the $600 range, but the point I'm trying to make here, guys, is that these pricings are lower than what you will pay currently in Hong Kong for the iPhone 12 mini and the iPhone 12. And to see pricing that is actually now lower, lower than the Hong Kong pricing, in India for these phones is incredible. I think this is a major piece of news here for all you guys who have always said that iPhones are just overpriced for what they're worth and seeing this whole assembled in India situation actually coming to fruition, seeing devices that are now gonna be available. Yes, they're not the newest devices, but the iPhone 12 to me really represents still an incredible value for an iPhone, but most importantly, an incredible value for you know for you guys as consumers to really try out for the first time possibly iOS see what it's all about and really see for yourself is this something that you want to use is this something that is truly a com a competitor to Android i think a lot of you guys have really dismissed iPhones in the past just because they were too expensive for what they were worth Tell me if you've done that. And I do believe for all my India audience out there that that has been the case. Not anymore, guys. If you can go pick up an iPhone 12 for that price or an iPhone 12 mini, I can tell you and I can promise you because I was literally just using that phone just a couple weeks back. It is an incredible device. The iPhone 12 Pro series, the 12 Pro Max. But you know what? The iPhone 12 itself with the aluminum edge represents an incredible device still as powerful in terms of CPU performance as my current 13 Pro Max with terrific cameras and just battery life that was really solid for the iPhone 12. I think it now represents one of the best values that you can pick up in India for yourself. But hit me up in the comments, guys. What are your thoughts on this made in India iPhone 12? And tell me the truth. Does this make now the iPhone potentially a more exciting and more relevant phone to consider for your next phone purchase. Hit me up in the comments, I'd love to hear about it. And that's it for this video. If you liked it, give me that thumbs up. And if you love the content of Frankie Tech, subscribe to the channel, hit the bell icon for future updates. Thanks for watching guys. And yeah, definitely interested to hear your thoughts. And this is where I leave you by saying, this is Frankie Tech signing off. Have a good one. And wrist check, wrist check, wrist check. I'm wearing the T-Cell PRX Powermatic 80. Awesome integrated brace, brace with a watch. Very cool indeed. Have a good one.